So just another update. Uh, everything was working after we after we replaced the um, gosh, what were the two parts? It was the amplifier, which is like a capacitor discharge, I guess. Uh, and rectifier. And, and a rectifier. We replaced those two things. Uh, this is the, I think I've showed them to you before. This is the amplifier. And then this is the rectifier. So we replaced those two. The boat ran fine. And then uh, when it, uh, it shut down with the key on, it there we we just about burn up a uh, uh, a diode. Well, I guess it did burn up a diode that's in your control box up here. You know that you that, that you, you know has the levers on it and so forth. And so we've determined that there is a short in the wire that goes down to the shift solenoids down here. And it looks like maybe there was an animal up there that helped that process along. Um, you want to show the picture of where you were looking down there and, and seeing the like yeah mm, i could try Maybe it's like way it. down in there yeah you see it yeah i think so yep that's it there it is yeah kind of looks like an animal yeah so we think that uh, that that wire is shorted out to the casing on the engine, and and it probably the insulation was had gotten eaten away. Uh, so the uh, so we're working on that piece right now, figuring out um, why the so could we went to shift it, and then the engine died. Shift it into reverse, the engine dies. So um, so the we're working that out that detail out right now, but. Uh, uh, the only problems that we've had with the engine so far have been electrical, uh, those parts that had the wires uh, that had deteriorated, and now this other deteriorated wire that goes down to the shift solenoids. So we're having to take a lower unit back off to uh, to see if, and we'll probably end up replacing just a short section of wire, probably 10 cents worth of wire, uh, to get this thing working right. All right, thanks.